feel lazy. Like, you just want to stay in your bathrobe and your sweatpants all day, and you're in your Zoom meetings, and maybe you have a nice shirt on, but like, you're in pajama pants. Yeah, same. And so does our beautiful butterfly, Rebecca. She specifically asked, Cassandra, what are your recommendations for lazy skincare? For the days that you don't want to wake up, for when you want something that is multitasking and that just takes the fuss out of it as few steps as possible. What's a girl supposed to do? And I got to thinking that Rebecca you are brilliant. Yes, lazy skincare would be fantastic, but is it actually lazy? Or is this the most multitasking, hardworking skincare available on the market? Think about laziness, right? Laziness or procrastination is putting something off into the last minute. It's like, why would I work for three months on this thesis paper when I could just save it off at the end and cram everything into 48 hours and I could save myself, you know, a good month and a half? You see, is it laziness or is it time effective multitasking logic? Ask a lazy person to do something and they will find the most efficient way to do it. And that is what I feel that these products do. Let's speak about some of the things that do double duty beauty and just get the job done, starting with this from Topicals. Topicals is a fantastic brand that has really been taken over the internet and Sephora, and yes, I have been testing it. And this right here is a butter hydrating mask. But might I say, I don't feel like this is just a hydrating mask. There's a lot of commentary online that this product pills, and when you apply it liberally, oh yes, it does pill. But that's why I feel this is the perfect mask. It's a hydrating mask because it really nourishes the skin, but it's also exfoliating. It pills up so much that it reminds me of one of those products that's like, oh, it's removing your dead skin cells, but this one isn't claiming to do that. If you wanted to use this as a moisturizer, I wouldn't recommend it, but this product definitely is smooth, like butter and it is definitely something that you can use as a mask and then you can start to wash it off and when you do it gives you this really beautiful glow without feeling sticky on the skin or without stripping you of hydration and it is really hard to find a product that delivers moisture into the skin but exfoliates too and I will say this is probably one of the most gentle exfoliants you could ever get it's not labeled as an exfoliant that's just the way that I use it because of how it kind of gums up and gently removes dead skin cells dirt and debris from the top of the skin do you ever watch Instagram and you get stuck on like ASMR Instagram and there's like these slime balls that people put in their car doors or on their keyboards and it just like absorbs all of the gunk. <laughs> This is not that sticky, but I almost feel like that's similar. Like it kind of balls up and just grabs everything and removes it from the face. If you're looking for one of the most mild physical exfoliants that you literally could use every single day, this as a mask works so well to hydrate and also to exfoliate. Topicals is a really cool brand that I'm trying out. There's a few other products that have just launched like an ingrown hair serum that I can't wait to try. But if you're looking for multitasking beauty, I have found this to be one of my favorites. I forgot to get something to wipe my hands. Of course I did. Wait. Now what if you're not looking for exfoliation or hydration, but you're looking to protect your skin from the sun's rays? Well, we spoke about buying into the hype with Glow Recipe. We've actually tested this product, and might I say, if you want to keep it bare bones and minimal, Glow Recipe has your back. This has a bunch of amazing ingredients that not only make your skin protected from the sun and look good and glowy, but it's also got niacinamide and skincare that actually works almost like a serum on your skin. Now, I do find that this product pills up a ton if you try to layer it with other things, and it really works best when it's on its own. But seeing as it has such a great list of ingredients, you actually can use this on its own, and it acts as a serum plus a sunscreen. It's a treatment plus a sunscreen that keeps you safe and protected. I really love this. I really do recommend recommend using this in singularity. And if you're looking for a product that just does it and you know you don't have like a lot of super sensitive reactions to getting sunscreen in your eyes or having something sting an open blemish or a little wound, Glow Recipe really did it with this one. And not to mention it smells amazing. And what about those who struggle with acne, rosacea, fungal acne, which technically doesn't exist. It's called pterosperm folliculitis or malassezia folliculitis. These skin conditions can look very similar and it's hard to tell them apart. Now, in order to figure out which one of these you have, you have to see a dermatologist. You have to get that diagnosed and treated by them. But if you don't know what it is and you're like waiting for your appointment to come so that you can get your skin checked out, Skin Fix has saved the day. They launched this cleanser that literally works for acne, rosacea, and fungal acne, AKA 
pterosperm or malassezia folliculitis. This is the Acne Plus 2% BHA cleanser, but this also has azelaic acid in it. This has azelaic acid, niacinamide, green tea, salicylic acid, and basically, if you're struggling with one of these conditions or multiple, this is so good. It is this milky, kind of pinkish color, and it goes onto the skin so well, and it actually helps to deal with these conditions in an over-the-counter way. Now, of course, if you have like a major rosacea flare or a major acne flare, you're going to need a prescription. Some super duty double tasking beauty could be things like from Apostrophe or Agency or Dermatica where they custom blend prescriptions and they put multiple actives into each prescription that's custom blended to you. So it's like, okay, it's really hardworking or is it lazy? I don't know. It's both, right? Like it's lazy. They put it all in one. But if you're looking for something over the counter, this cleanser really does not disappoint. And Skin Fix also launched a spot treatment. This is one that has kaolin clay and it kind of melts into the skin. But for those who are confused about what's going on with their skin or don't have telehealth or haven't had a chance to get a diagnosis, then you either know that it's acne, rosacea, or fungal acne, or you think it's one of the three, but you're not sure which, this is a really great place to start. They're available at Sephora. They're relatively affordable, all vegan and cruelty-free, and they do have this recycled packaging Skin Fix, I don't think it's available in Canada, but it is made in Canada. And their formulas are badass. If you are looking for a product that literally does it all, but does it well, whether you call that lazy or multitasking and hardworking, I don't know. Maybe those terms are synonymous and they just feel like polar opposites. Like, are we living in the matrix? Potentially. But overall, Skin Fix has been delivering since their blue line with their Barrier Plus products. They did it again with the acne rosacea pterosperm folliculitis ones. And would this even be a double duty beauty without talking about Beauty Pie and their super retinol serums? I have been using this every day for so long. And while this is technically a night treatment, Beauty Pie has such good formulas that actually stabilize hard to mix ingredients. Vitamin C and retinoids don't always go together. Vitamin C normally penetrates the skin with a more acidic pH, whereas retinoids have a more neutral pH. And a lot of publications even online are like, they don't blend together. Well, if they're formulas properly, especially if they are encapsulated, then they absolutely do. This is encapsulated retinol with ferulic acid and vitamin C. And although they say it's a night treatment, I use this during the day. This is one of my favorite products from Beauty Pie outside of their little capsules. They have ceramide capsules now. They also have the resveratrol and the vitamin C. But this is such a good lazy skincare or multitasking beauty if you're looking for a retinoid as well as a vitamin C. I actually love to apply this during the day under my sunscreen. It doesn't tend to ball up or to pill up unless you use it with a glow recipe sunscreen, but that's because this freaking thing pills up with everything. But for most sunscreens, this is such a lovely pair. And it brings together two ingredients that we hardly ever see together. It's like, you know those two people that you thought they could never make it work? They could never get together? It's just not a possibility? Beauty Pie went in and they said, oh yes, we can. We're like the magical marriage therapist, counselor, psychoanalyst, PhD, and we are making this relationship work like magic. And they literally do. <laughs> if you want the benefits of retinol, from the anti-aging to the acne to the cellular renewal, all the way to the benefits of vitamin C as an antioxidant and a brightener, this one is it. And it takes the guesswork out. Now, if you don't have a Beauty Pie, you know, membership, you can still buy it, but it's like expensive. Beauty Pie is basically a luxury brand created in the exact same factories and by the same manufacturers that create very luxury high-end skincare, which is why their formulas are so luxurious, but they're also kind of like a Costco. So if you have a membership, you get to buy the products at a discounted rate. That is what I do. I always stock up on these. I've been giving some of these away in some of our beautiful butterfly live streams. But overall, this is an MVP that my routine loves and that any lazy skin who wants the benefits of both will die for. And in a good way, not like die for. Is that, why do we use the word die? Like I'm dead for laughter. There was a YouTube video talking about how like the youth is so depressed that we use like terms synonymous with like depression and death to explain our humor. Anyways, now if you're looking for another hardworking retinoid that is not combined with vitamin C, oh, I just hate that this is an eye cream, but I love this product. This is from Verse. This is the Smooth Landing Advanced Retinol Eye Balm. And this is basically a retinoid in Vaseline. If you like the Vaseline feel, if you like it thick, but if you're like, yo, I wish that I had a retinoid, like I sandwich my retinoid all the time. You know, you use Vaseline, retinoid, then more Vaseline, and it's just like, I'm sick of doing three layers to get my retinoid on at night. 
this takes the guesswork out for you. It is retinol, so it's more gentle than what you would get in a prescription, but it's literally this creamy, thick, petrolatum jelly texture and formula that is literally a balm that goes onto the skin and it protects and nourishes and it helps with dryness, but at the same time, it gives you those benefits of a retinoid. I'm just so mad that this is an eye cream. I wish that they made this in a huge tub. You can use this as an eye cream. It's totally fine to do. And it's actually really good for fine lines and wrinkles because of that retinoid action inside of it. But I would also recommend smearing this all over the face because of how well this works. I literally wish that they made this in a tub just the way they do Salimo jelly or Vaseline. Like that is what I'm waiting for. Verst did such a good job with this. And it is one of the best multitasking beauty things I've ever tried. Like if you're sick of sandwiching your retinoid, this takes the guesswork out of it. It does it for you. And I know we started off first or second with a sunscreen, but we've got to finish it up with a sunscreen too. Because what if you're trying to apply sunscreen to protect your skin, but you're also like, I want to wear makeup and I hate to put my sunscreen on, wait for it to soak in, then apply my makeup, hope that it doesn't ball and pill up. Like it just doesn't work. And especially if you're using the glow recipe, you're like, I can't apply makeup because it pills up. Like it just doesn't work. What are you supposed to do? My dear, Two in one, all the fun. Literally, Sun Better Skin Science has so many fantastic sunscreens that are basically makeup. They literally have their Tone Smart Sunscreen Compact. This is what I would highly recommend. They also have a more blue one of these. It's basically a medium to full coverage foundation with SPF 75. And because it's SPF 75, you still need to reapply, but you don't have to reapply as quickly. This is such a phenomenal brand overall. It's like luxury makeup makeup for a skin intellectual. The ingredients are fantastic. Their formulas are really smooth. And this literally helps to cover up imperfections on the skin. It literally comes with like a little sponge. You can of course switch the sponge out as you need to, but whether you use the compact that's literally just makeup with SPF 75, or if you go ahead and actually use the more liquid one that literally feels like a foundation, do you see how nicely that goes onto the skin? Like it looks like I have perfect, beautiful skin. It's protected from the sun. And I've literally done a skincare treatment plus sunscreen plus my makeup all in one. And then if you really wanted to, you could use one of those sunscreen brushes over the top. Color Science has one. Sandra Lee MD has one. Jane Iredale has one of the most luxurious ones. These little things are fantastic and they are double duty beauty at its finest. There are actually a lot of sunscreen makeup products that I feel like nobody else is talking about. And I don't know if it's because people just don't know about them. We've actually used a couple of them before. I think that Color Science is really at like the cutting edge of these. Do you see how they have these like bronzer sticks or these lipsticks oh that melted or these makeup sticks they were all crumbly yeah this one melted oopsie daisy but these are absolutely gorgeous and if you're looking for something that does double duty beauty and gives you a little bit of a makeup look as well as sun protection mwah, the sunscreen hybrid makeup products are it and if you really want to know how to get like a full face of no makeup makeup only by using skincare so you could technically get away with saying I'm not wearing any makeup we actually did a video on how the big booty gurus and the big influencers and even some of the celebrities get away with doing that by using some of these lazy or arguably some of the most hardworking products that are out there that give you some double duty beauty. Which of these is your favorite? Which of these are you slapping on your face? And tell me a story about one of the laziest moments that you had that ended up also being one of the most efficient. One example that comes to my mind is this guy finding a unique way to walk his dog. I'm gonna wash my hands and I want you to reapply your sunscreen and be beautiful both inside and out. I love you and I cannot wait to see you in this next video. <sighs> Bye my beautiful butterflies.